Hi, I'm Renee and welcome to my channel. So it's the Sephora VIB Spring Sale event and this video is going to be my show and tell haul. So we're just going to jump right in and I picked up four of the Galan Rouge G lipstick cases. I have Hype Purple, Rosy Nude, Minimal Cheek, and K-Doll. So I'll just open these up real quick. I am a big fan of the Guerlain Rouge G line. I have a lot of their cases. So this one is Rosy Nude. This one is height purple. And they've recently launched a new line um, of jewel tone cases. I have those. I did not get them from Sephora. This is minimal chic. Oh, look at that. And these are colors that have been on my list to get for a while, since last year actually. So I took advantage of the sale just to go ahead and cross them off of my list. And this is Kato. Beautiful. Okay. I'm trying to find where I can move these. The next item I got are the Shiseido facial cotton pads. I got the 165 count. I love these cotton pads. Please, please, please do not continue to buy luxury makeup, but still use the cheap <laughs> linty cotton pads that fall apart and leave lint all over your face. Indulge your skin, indulge your face with these 100% cotton pads. They are luxurious to use. I, I'm about to run out, but I pulled some out of the pack that I still have. See how thick they are? And they're soft and they have like a good enough size for you you know, to remove your makeup, apply your toner, whatever it is that you're doing. And they're tough. So you can, they don't like break apart on you like some of the cheaper ones do. I have used these for years. I'm never going back. I highly recommend. Okay. Let's see, I guess next up I purchased a lot of lip balms. I ran out and one thing, for some reason, I barely make a dent in my makeup products, but when it comes to lip balm, I go through it like water. So since I ran out, I took this opportunity to experiment with different brands. Now this here is the Pharmacy Honey Butter lip balm. This is my third tube. I, when did I get my first one? I think I got the very first one. Um, I want to say November. And since then, so far, this is, this has become a staple. Um, and now this is my third one. I really like it. It's 100% natural, very good ingredients. Um, what I like about it is that it feels moisturizing when I apply it and it has a thickness to it that kind of just stays on the lips without like evaporating too quickly but it doesn't feel so heavy that it's uncomfortable. I, I really enjoy this lip balm. The next one is the Dior Attic Lip Glow. Now, I tried my first one in the color Berry. Um, I believe I got it as a holiday gift. Um, I, I wanted to try more colors. This one is 001 pink, but I specifically wanted to get this one 
that has the Dior logo on the casing. This is a special limited edition design. So I wanted to pick this up before um, they sold out. But this is the color and it's, it's a tinted lip balm. I wouldn't necessarily describe it as moisturizing. It feels more like a sealant to the lips to me. Um, I almost feel like I have to have my lips already kind of moisturized. Then I apply the lip glow and it, main, it seals in that moisture that I already have. It has a slight tacky texture to it, kind of like a lip gloss, but not quite full on lip gloss. It's somewhere in between a lip balm and a lip gloss to me. That's how I would describe it. And it just puts on a nice hint of color to your lips. So I really like it. Now this, I saw this when I was browsing the website, is the Sephora Favorites Give Me Some Balm Lip Kit. And it's $29. So this is something I think is a great value to pick up during the, the savings event. So let's just open it up right now. It's multiple lip balms in the, in the bag. Okay, there we go. I have no idea what that <laughs> squeaky noise was opening the bag, but okay. So let's see what did we get. So we get one, two, three, four, five lip balm samples. Two of them are supposed to be full size. So here we have the Pat McGrath lip balm. Now. This will be my very first Pat McGrath lipstick items. I had never tried her brand before, even though I've seen it. Something, I don't know, it may just be me. It may just be me. But something about the lips <laughs> bother me a little bit with the casing. I don't know what it is. But I've still been curious to try it. And so this is that lip balm. I'm not going to swatch any of these because they'll just show up clear, you know, on my skin. So you receive a full size um, Pat McGrath lip balm. You also receive a full size Tarte lip balm. I have never used the Tarte brand before. I've seen it, of course, but never, just never something I was gravitated to try. But, you know, in a package for $29, why not? And then we have the Fresh Sugar Lip Treatment. Hmm. So that's a sample size. And we have the, what is this? It's a lip balm, I'm not sure the brand and I'm having trouble opening it so we'll just set this aside and then it also includes a lip enhancer from Jower so there we go with that so I don't know, maybe I could do a Battle of the Bombs <laughs> video later on uh, just to see. But I know I'm really curious in trying this. And like I said, this is now a staple for me. And I really like having the Dior logo all over the lip glow package. Okay, so moving on. So, the next two items, these were not planned. These were completely spontaneous. I have had my eye on these Gucci lipsticks 
I was planning to get them over the summer, but the sale made me do it. <laughs> I picked them up early. Um, I got one lip balm and one sheer lip color. So I was actually, okay, I know I said that they were spontaneous purchases, but I was only going to get a lipstick just because, oh my goodness, look at this case. Oh, I saw this and I just fell in love with the details. It is just so gorgeous. Man, so this is sheer. I got the color, what color did I pick up? It was May or My Coral. It's spring. I wanted something that was light, colorful, not too dark or heavy. I just wanted a lighter color lipstick. And you know what? I'll go ahead and I'll do a quick swatch. It's sheer. That's going to be pretty. Okay, so like I said, I was only going to splurge on getting the lipstick, but then, like I said, I needed some lip balms. And then, oh, oh, just this, this, I love this color. I go nuts over this color, this like mint turquoise teal type of colors it's just so gorgeous to me i was going to stay strong i was not going to get this however this has my name in it renee pink how can i pass that up come on so this is the lip balm again another very pretty color let's see what that looks like <laughs> it almost seems similar, except since this is a lip balm, I can even tell on the hand swatch, there's, there's like, um, it's more moisturizing. I can feel it on my skin, but yes, this should be fun. And oh my gosh, I, I can always tell when I'm about to get obsessive over something and you'll probably see more of these popping up in the next <laughs> few months i could tell you that much okay so moving along and the last thing i purchase is a nars blush now i am a nars blush fanatic in fact i'm going to do an upcoming video where i'm going to swatch my entire collection of nars blush this color is number 40 in my collection. This is the color Dominate. It's one of the new colors that released earlier this year. Let me cover up the mirror. Look at that. Oh, it is stunning. Look at how stunning that is. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Very complimentary to darker skin tones. Let's swatch it. Love the texture. Okay. Beautiful berry tone. Just beautiful. Like I said, this is going to be added to my collection that I will do a complete swatch fest of. Um, that's it for my Sephora haul. I don't think I went too crazy. <laughs> I think I did very well, so I'm going to pat myself on the back. Um, Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Let me know if you shop to sell and what items you purchased or plan to get. Did anything I purchased, you know, you want to add to your list? Let me know. 
Thanks again. Bye.